Hello, 56th grade. This is your video for Friday for history. For pages 287 to 289, you have one work text page, page 209. But let's go ahead and get right into the reading here. Religion. During the Han period, religion was a part of everyday life. Japanese blended Shintoism with Buddhism. Often Shinto uh, shrines were constructed near or on the property of Buddhist temples. Japanese began combining the divine beings of Buddhism with the Shinto gods. They worshipped at Shinto shrines to obtain help for their daily lives. They worshipped in Buddhist temples to prepare for the life to come. Religion shaped Japanese culture and affected art, architecture, and education. Government. During the Han period, <clears throat> Japan's central government was strong, but it would soon be challenged. Instead of the emperor being an authority, the key posts in government came to rest in the hands of powerful families. One family, the Fujiwara, sought to control the government. They had their daughters marry the sons of the imperial family. Fujiwari would then persuade the reigning emperor to give up his throne to an heir born to one of these daughters. The Fujiwari then ruled as regents for their child emperor. As regents, this family held much influence at court. In addition to the regents, aristocrats um, helped run the country. These aristocrats were assigned a rank in order, uh, a rank in order to hold an office in government. The emperor held the highest rank. Nobles who served as ministers of state were second or third place. The fourth or fifth rank was filled by young nobles. The Fujiwara family controlled the Japanese government from 794 to 1185, a large portion of the Han period. The family became wealthy and powerful, but the Fujiwara also brought corruption to the government. By 1156, the country was in a civil war. After almost 30 years of fighting, the power struggle ended with the rule of Japan shifting to military officials who were landowners in the provinces. A warrior clan, the Gen Genji, uh, defeated a rival clan, the Heiki. The Genji created a government run by military generals. Although um, the line of the imperial family continued, the emperor did not have, a signif have sig significant power. This brought in the feudal age of Japan. Um, feudalism is something that um, many countries had to deal with or did deal with. But we'll go ahead and talk about these next two pages here. Um, feudalism, by the way, is a, a method where the, uh, the ones who are the landowners basically have the power. Um, they become feudal lords. They, they become lords of the areas where they, um, of the land they own. And the people that live on them become their servants, so, so to speak. Organized cities and governments. During the Han period, the court experienced an extended time of political strength and peace. After a while, the Fujiwara family began to control the imperial family. Later, political power shifted to military leaders. Justice. Certain marriage practices led to injustice. The Fujiwara family controlled the royal line by marrying their daughters to imperial heirs. In this way, the Fujiwara family was able to attach itself to the imperial family to gain power. Social classes. Aristocrats were assigned a rank in society. The emperor held the highest position. The second and third ranks were made up of the highest nobles who served as ministers of state. The fourth or fifth rank were young nobles and some members of the ruling class in the country. Clerks, skilled workers, and bureaucrats comprised the lower ranks. Environment. Hankyo was established on Honshu Island. It was located on a fertile plain with rivers. The area was good for rice and silk farms. Mountains in the north and several rivers were natural barriers for defense. The climate included silk, uh, hot summers with cold winters. Religion. Shintoism and Buddhism became common in most, and some people practiced a mixture of the two religions. You have... Um, um, the next page and the last one that we're reading today, art, science, and written language. The Japanese practiced Chinese art, but also developed their own art forms, characterized by the use of brilliant colors and depictions of everyday objects. The Japanese created a special art form by arranging flowers. The Japanese used simple, airy designs for buildings and encircled them with elegant gardens and ponds. Most literature was written by noble women and was, the common Japanese, was in the common Japanese language. Citizenship. The elite made up a small part of the population and lived in luxury. Without those rank, or those without rank, um, such as peasants, merchants, and craftspeople, paid taxes to the government and taxes to the landlords. Where you get feudalism there. Key themes of civilization: justice, power, citizenship, and environment. And then features of a civilization: organized cities and government, social classes. Um, you notice they don't have special job specialization in the. Um, Themes of um, civilization and power aren't bolded, which means they aren't emphasized here in Hain Kyo. 
Um, art science is a written language and religion, and in broad avenues the streets ran parallel and at right angles, making it easy to travel through the city. It makes it a lot easier when it's uh, set up that way. All right, that's it for your video for Friday, um, last day of April. Have a good weekend. Hopefully see you next Wednesday. That's the earliest I'm able to come back. We'll see what happens. All right, have a good day. Bye.